top. One in that first set. Wayne now really he's got to hold his throw in this set. Can't afford to go two sets to nil down. 85. Uh, Carver chasing a quarter-final place and also chasing important money in the uh, North American order of merit because uh, the place is up for grabs for the top Americans in both the Grand Nine Slam of darts and the big one at the end of the year, the World Championship, and he'll be battling out with the likes of uh, John Kaczynski and Gary Mawson and Brad Wethington and a whole load more who... We'll be desperate to get to the World Championship. Difference between winning and losing as far as money concerned. 92. 3,000 for losing at this stage. 4,000 guaranteed for reaching the, the quarterfinals. Oh, he needs a treble. Ray Carver needs a treble. 57. No, not quite enough. Why Model require, now. I May only have one dart at the bullseye. No, he's going to have two at double 16. Go Game one leg up. Good the clean kill leg. there from Wayne. Wayne two Arnold. out of two on doubles. Second leg is ready to throw first. Game on. Mardle, of course, just, just missed out on a, a semi final place 16. in the Premier League. One hundred. Still one of the or arguably the most popular darts player in the world, isn't he? Where, wherever you go, wherever the big tournaments are, you see hundreds and hundreds of Mardler fans all kitted out in their Hawaii you know, shirts. And yeah, you certainly do. You know, him and Peter Manley are real big characters in this game. They, uh, they're professional in their job, you know. They, they, they play the darts, and the other side of them, they, manage the, they both manage themselves, you know, so they make the best of... What they can to earn a living, and, uh, and like Peter Manley, he's hoping to retire early, which, uh, you know, good luck to him. Don't believe a word of it. Ma darts without Mardle. He's had Mardle without 180s, and he's given himself a great chance here to win the set here and now against the throw. 125. It was always going to be a quick fire match, two of the quickest throwers about. Well, had the one dart there at double 16, but he will be back for another chance. He'll have at least three more. Yeah, Carver will probably feel Nine the way two. Wayne's hitting doubles that he won't Wayne miss it. So he didn't matter a bad hit and a bad score. Game and he did, that's three out of three on doubles set. there for Mardle. Wayne Mardle. Really is pinning that double. And set. Stuart, first when you're a player right and you are hitting that double first dart, it gives you confidence because you think, I've only got to keep with my opponent, and he gives me a chance, I'm going to take 61. it. And uh, the way the game's going, it could be that one leg, that one missed double that could cost a player. 100. Yeah, Mardle warming to the task, losing the first set, Carver taking out 120, but uh, some clinical darts from Mardle in that second set. 83. Big chance here for Wayne if he can get a 140. No, he needs a straight ton. 100. Well, it's 50 percent there, getting the throw back. What he'd be hoping now to do is that Ray doesn't hit a treble. Then he has got the throw back. Oh, important dart this for Carver. 60. Well, now Mardle, big chance here for Wayne. 100. Uh, disappointed there because there was a lot of room. I think he actually thought that the third dart was in the treble. Well, those two certainly are. One those three certainly are. That's a great response. You know, you've lost the throw by a hundred. You get it straight back, but Mardle straight in there. One hundred and thirty-eight. Well, one hundred and seventeen for Carver to hold his throw in his third set. Seventeen for double top. Double top. 97. Why well, he earned the right 63. to have at least one dart for the leg. Well, he wants double 16. 47. First time he's missed it. 
Ray require 20. Yeah, Mardlin was coasting, but the, the 180 from, from Carver Game put the pressure on, and that's a good leg to win Ray for Ray Carver. Second leg, you to throw Collins. He's got a lovely throw as well, you've got to say, for a left-hander. You know, sometimes in darts, it, it can be awkward, but it's a lovely, smooth, flowing throw. Yeah, exactly right. No tension in the arm or in the neck. Keeps the head nice and still. Wayne, on the other hand, tends to just lurch. As we see with that third dart, but it went in to Carver. Good solid stance as well. There's not a lot that can go wrong with his throw. And at the moment, there's not a lot that is going 99. wrong. Yeah, good match up this. We thought it would be. Still to come. 45. Uh, final match of the night. The two best mates. Roland Shelton against Colin Lloyd. And that'll round up the, uh, the second day of the US Open. Of course, Sunday night from 7 o'clock, we've got the quarterfinals, the semis, and of course the final. Can Phil Taylor defend his crown here at the Mohegan Sun in Connecticut? Well, Aloha, Hawaii 5 0. Is it going to be a good night? Hawaii 5 0. Carver will be trying his absolute best to make sure that happens. But yeah. We're finishing off with a great game tonight. I do fancy Colin Lloyd to win that. That's I think he's just got the firepower Wayne to overcome Roland Shelton. But the only place you can see it is live on Nuts TV. He wants the bullseye. No. Yeah, that was that was sensible throw by Mardle. Carver way behind. 100. Why do you require 32? Game show. Well, that second gives us a level leg. game, a set of piece, a, a leg of piece. And Third reaching leg. one of those crucial moments, this, the game most on. important leg of this match so far. Can Mardle break the throw, take the set? Come out in the fourth set, throwing for the match, or can Carver go 2 1 up? Well, 100. this is exactly where Chris Mason nicked the leg to nick the set, made him go on and win. Wasn't playing to Chris Mason's standard, but stuck in there. And I said, this is a crucial leg here for 40. Wayne. And he's sitting there. There's, there's a little inkling. Wayne's thinking, this is the chance. I need a 140. Yeah, Mason beating Roger Carter earlier on. 81. If he disappoints him in that final dart. Now, may come down, the angle that he throws the darts, that, that was just completely 96. blocking the treble 20 bed, but a good last dart there. Oh, that's a great first dart. Needs a 140, got to hit this one. 100. And you can see, disappointed again, he should have had a 140, which would have put him a ton in front of Carver. He's just got to now, Wayne will stand behind Ray going, please don't hit a treble 20. If he doesn't hit a treble, Wayne gets the advantage in the leg. Well, under, I really cannot understand he went for a 25 there. Well, Mardle has the darts now. Yeah, he knows. Just taking a step back. Just one treble here could make.